So how are we feeling? Very nervous. Very excited. Yeah. Can't wait. You ready, ready to walk down the aisle in that? I am. I think everyone's going to be surprised. I'm so excited. Um, it's not an easy task for me to stand before you, wonderful people, this uh, evening. I'm not a man of many words, but I'll try not to disappoint my son. I'm so thankful that my son has found a treasure. When my son found Danny, I was so thrilled with him along with the rest of the family. We were so excited to get to meet a woman who makes Seva so complete. Danny, we have never seen Seva as happy as he is than he is by your side. And I am grateful that I was able to witness my son fall in love and get married to the woman of his dreams. Uh, to Mr. and Mrs. Roach, if I may say less and Galen, thank you so much for your beautiful daughter. Now that we have made it official, I love you like my own daughter. See the rest of my The bond between a father and a daughter is a very special thing. My girls were always, were always and always be daddy girl, daddy's girls. I used to have both of them on my lap for breakfast and when I got home from work. As soon as I met Seva, he was going to be number one. Just knew it. When I met Seva, we knew instantly that Danny had found the true gentleman and her future was mapped out. I want to congratulate Va and Sai for bringing up such a truly beautiful man. Before Danny's hens do, I sent Seva a list of questions so we could, could all get to know the groom. Um, and his answers were all so wholesome. But the answer that stood out to me, and Tara, who cried at the time, but she's pregnant, guys, <laughs> was that the thing Seva is most afraid of is not spending eternity with Danny. So on that note, I wish you both all the happiness and joy in the world. So if we could all raise our glasses to Danny, Seva, and eternity. <laughs> Seva came down to, from Auckland to help me build a shed that I was really grateful for, but I think he had an ulterior motive. <laughs> On that trip he said, I want to ask your daughter's hand in marriage. And I went, really? We, um, we had a lot of good nights out together. We would go out drinking a few times, and he was, he was definitely the, the one more drink kind of guy. He'd say, oh, you know, it's time to go home, you know, but I've had enough, I want to go. But no, 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 one more drink, one more drink, it's fine. But eventually, um, he stops being that guy. 
He started to be the guy that would sort of, he would be happy to leave a bit early. And he'd even leave before everybody else. And then of course we found out that was because of a girl. Correct me if I'm wrong, Danny, but I think we, I finally met you. And I took a look at you and I thought, how the hell did Siva do that? <laughs> But then, then I got to know you, Danny. I had a few chats with you a few times, and to be honest, that left me with more questions than answers. I realised you've got your head screwed on. You, you know what you're doing. You're a smart girl. But still, he made it work, and we, we don't know how. However he's doing it, let's just hope he never, never lets you clue up, because we don't, we don't want that to happen. Truly an amazing person. I think everyone knows this. We're all here because of it. You are so kind, so generous, so lovely. To the point that if me and my wife are ever hanging out with the two of you, we have to not tell my five-year-old daughter. Because if she hears your name, that's it. She's not going to bed that night. She's, she's going to stay awake until she sees you. See if she can take or leave. She doesn't really care too much about him, but, but Danny, definitely you. She absolutely loves you to bits, and that's, it's so obvious why. Hi, B. Yeah. Let's do this. Been engaged for two and a half years, so this day has been planned for a long time, and um, I'm so excited. Um, I'm so excited to just walk in and just see him at the end of the aisle. Um, I know he'll look incredible. I feel alive, I feel alive, feeling like I'm ten feet tall. I feel alive, I feel alive, feeling like I'm whiskey pool. Ooh, I'm part of the chosen. Every day I'm feeling bold. I feel alive, I feel alive, I feel alive. Sorry guys, give me a minute. <laughs> Danny, in your eyes, I found a home. In your heart, I found my love. In your soul, I found my name. I love you for it and always. The kind of love I share for you is unlike anything I've ever felt before. And I've never dreamt of a weapon of my own until I met you. And I can't believe you're trying to serve to be like that. Swiping right four years ago, taking the time to do the least decision of my life. For the first time. Seva's beautiful mother, Vasumave, is going to come forward now with, with a Salu Salu. Danny receiving this today on their wedding day on a special occasion binds the family relationship with the Fijian society and the Nomborisi family. I think we all want to be adopted by your Vovali. Like I feel alive, I feel alive.